cat here. And this is my new setup, I guess. I'm kind of sad this poster isn't showing completely, but it's, it's fine. Anyways, today is the quarantine... Oh. <laughs> the Closet Quarantine Cosplay Challenge from Life Cove the Fox, because... She's one of my favorite Five Nights at YouTubers. And I'm going to be cosplaying as well. Today we're going to be doing Toy Bonnie because I have this headband here. So, first, I'm going to put on the makeup because, yeah. But I have to go put on some hair clips so that my hair isn't in the way. Uh, wait. I couldn't find any other hair clips, so I'm going to be putting these flowers in my hair. Because why not? This will work. These are, uh, I think, pretty old. There we go. The hair is not in the way anymore. So, I don't have any real makeup. I'll just be using, uh, Halloween makeup. So, so yeah. I think how, uh, these are the instructions. I think how it works is I have to put on this cream makeup here. Ah, yeah. So I think I have to put this on first, and then put on the grease makeup. So this is going to happen eventually hmm so I'm gonna get a pair of scissors to open this okay so I have the scissors and we are now on a cardboard box so that I can apply my makeup over it. Also, I'm using graphic novel. I'm using manga to hold up my phone right now because what I was using before is not working anymore. And uh, I have this this Ziploc bag that is used, that I was using to hold this because I thought it spilled. So I'm going to put it all onto the Ziploc bag. And then apply it to my face. Well, uh, I'll try to get more out in a bit with these sponges. I don't know how I feel applying this to my face, but we're doing it anyway. I should turn on a light. One moment. Lucky me, the light switch is literally right next to me, so I have to put this on now. And we will speed it because... I have to do that. Okay, so I have to stop the video and then record again so we have separate videos.
I've never applied this to my face before. It does feel like cream, I will tell you that much. It smells like a lotion. I don't wear lotion usually. <laughs> yeah, like, like, um, okay, not, not normal lotion, okay, okay, my bad. I just go closer like, you need to watch me put this stuff on. I'm also using this as a mirror because I don't have a mirror on me right now. Oops. <laughs> I know how to apply makeup. People do apply makeup on their eyes anyway, so... Like, not, not on the actual eyeball, but like... Okay, let's... Wait. That happened. Uh, that was not supposed to happen. I feel like I'm cosplaying as Michael Myers now. <laughs> Just painting my entire face white. This should be enough, I think. Okay. And now, I will apply blue to my face. This, this blue right here. So. We'll do this with a different one. Oopsies. I'll have to do that. We fix that later. Okay. And then it's supposed to go on much easier with uh, this blue on. So, yay! 
So now we are painting my entire face blue. Because why not? Why wouldn't you paint your entire face blue? I think that it meant for me to put foundation on under this, but I don't have foundation. We are working on the flaws. Corrupted hardware. Isn't this spectacular? I'm a blueberry. I'm a blueberry. <laughs> And now I will off camera check for flaws and fix them because I have to get my phone all up in my face. That's how I touched up the this stuff, the cream makeup. So yeah, I'll do that and I'll get back to you. Okay. So that's done. Now I have to paint my nose right now. Just painting my nose because I'm painting my nose. And where is he? I'm cosplaying as a rabbit. And nose is a different color than the face. Bugs Bunny move through. There's a new rabbit in town. I don't know. I'm saying stuff that I think is funny, but really it's not. Okay. So, now I have to draw on eyebrows because I do because you can barely see my eyebrows so I'm just kind of kind of like color over my eyebrow to make it more visible And, uh, oops. There we go. That was terrible. Ah, let's go over.
Okay. Well then, I have to do this off camera as well. So. Now that that is done, it's time for what makes a toy animatronic a toy animatronic. What makes a killer animatronic a killer animatronic? <laughs> okay. And that should be the makeup completed. So, if the makeup's completed, there's only one thing left. And that's the head, the ears. So of course I want my hair to cover my real ears. And that's what I'm gonna do. I don't own like a wig or anything to put on over like other people do. But anyway, here we are.